so hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel i hope you guys are doing great and today's video i'm going to talk about a very cool add-on that's name is gardener add-on and what it does exactly so with this add-on you can create very fabulous and dynamic and beautiful gardens okay and i have downloaded this uh, add-on from the blender market here you can see from here you can buy okay there is three kind of license whatever you suitable to you you can just purchase from there so in this video i'm going to talk about how you can use this add-on and if you purchase it so i'm gonna show you how you can do this so first of all here you can see guys i have already installed this add-on or on the right hand side you can see we have that gardener add-on basically and this is the little ui of this add-on so first of all what do you need to do basically so for creating the uh, gardens you need one uh, mesh object basically so i'm just gonna add one plane here i'm just gonna scale it a little bit something like that and i'm just gonna apply this scale first of all so what we have to do first of all so we need to just select this little add dropper and select this mesh and after that here you can see these option gonna highlighted and you have to just click it and here you can see we have a lots of gardening and lots of plants and lots of uh, gardening styling basically so you can choose from there so for example i just want to take uh, this one so i'm just gonna click it double click so after selecting this you need to just click this load icon and here and here you can see guys it will automatically create the whole gardening for you and if you want to see so you i'm just gonna switch into my rendering mode and here you can see guys that's look awesome by the way i'm just gonna switch into my material preview so you can see better so here we go so all right here you can see here we go and here you can see now uh we have a fabulous gardening option here okay and now there are lots of options here basically okay you can just randomize these whole garden basically you can scale the uh, particles you can scale the uh, trees you can scale the flowers according to your desire you can rotate it you can hide from the viewport you can only show in the renders from here you can do each and everything basically and if you want to change it so you can just change anytime whenever you want to change so what do you need to for that you have to just again click this little icon and you can choose any of them from here i'm just i just want to click this one so here you can see it will automatically create it you need to just click load and it will automatically create it here you can see guys so here we go guys here you can see we have a now more flowers and more uh, trees here and which is look nice so let me just open a new project file once more so now right now what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna add one uh, torso here basically something like that and i'm just gonna again my gardener tool and i will just select this mesh as a emitter and then i'm just gonna select the any of them from here i'm just gonna add the this one basically and i will just click the load so now here we go guys here you can see you can add the gardener tool into any shapes so right now here you can see that's look nice if i'm just gonna turn into my rendering mode so that's look fabulous by the way here we go which is look super nice yeah so that's great and you can choose any kind of shape basically you can create by own also so for example i'm just gonna uh, add one cube here and let me just uh, deform this cube little bit something like that for example you want to add the gardener into this shape so what you need to do you have to just select from the emitter this mesh and after that you can choose any of them from here and you have to just click load and here we go guys so it will automatically create the flowers gardener or flowers and gardens according to your shape and which is look nice by the way and that's so great and now i'm just gonna switch into my rendering mode and here we go so here you can see so that is very cool feature and you can create according to your desire according to your uh, creativity if you can, and if you want to create a flower gate so you can just create a basic shape of the gate and after that you can just use as an emitter and you can choose the any style from here and it will automatically create a fabulous gate to you also so that's great and one feature also i like it in this add-on basically and what is that feature you can just load the trunk from here here you can see we have a lots of trunk here so for example i want uh, this trunk so you can just choose from here okay after selecting the trunk you can just load trunk and it will automatically create the trunk for you here you can see and i'm just gonna switch it to here basically and now you can add okay now you can select this trunk as an emitter and now you can add the any of uh, flower into this trunk basically so here we go guys yeah so here you can see that's look great now i'm just going to switch into my rendering mode and here we go 
so now you can add the any flower any gardens into our trunk also okay if you want to change the trunk you can just click it load it and it will automatically change it here you can see so all that guys i hope you learn how to use this gardener add-on and uh, and that is very easy and cool add-ons and lots of options are self-explained so i don't need to explain more much in this video uh, the main thing is that how you can import the and how you can add the garden into a mesh which is a tricky part which is i have already shown you here what you need to do for this you need to just add one mesh first of all after that you have to just select as an emitter then you can use any of them which is are showing here basically so that is a little tricky part which is i want to show you and there are lots of options also you can see and you can just uh, explore this add-on and create some creative stops so thanks for watching this video guys if you learned something in this video please hit the like button the share button and subscribe my channel also if you have any queries if you have any session please let me know in the comment box i will definitely reply comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys